such a breathtaking view. You see the arches, the water tower, some trees, and of course our friends as they enjoy the openness of the wilderness. Wow, that was probably the most fun thing I've ever said. Uh, but anyway, greetings, ladies and gentlemen. It's my Angel 4 here, and welcome back to some more Final Fantasy 15. Not gonna lie, I was about to say World of Final Fantasy there, but no, not not today. Maybe tomorrow. Wait. As last time, we completed Chapter 4 and Chapter 5. Or wait, actually, complete Chapter complete Chapter 3 spots. But yeah, we did that, all that, and well, it was quite interesting. You know, we ran into a god. Got powers of another god, possibly fought a ripoff of Naga from Fire Emblem. You know, it was a very interesting time, it really was. So if you are at all curious as to what any of that I'm talking about is, go check out the previous, I think actually 10 videos, because the first section was uh, divided into 5 episodes, and I had to record another session just to finish up the other 5 because of editing problems. So yeah, go check out the previous 10 videos if you are at all curious as to what happened. But anyway, today, we're going to be engaging the Empire as we need to devise a strategy here at our base camp. And only this base camp for some reason. Don't know why, just is. But before we do th even that... Oh, not that. I've done some leveling up off-screen. And we are now at level 24 with Noctis and Gladiolus. 23 with Ignis, and 22 with Prompto. So yeah, not much of a change in level up, but it's something. And as you can already tell, we've got 929 experience. Uh, you know, this was just from uh, grinding last night, so yeah. Oh, that's a, actually, that's something I never noticed before. At the bottom left, we can see what armagers we have. Oh, cool. Very uh, unique. Oh uh, yeah, we did some leveling up. And before we also uh, head on over to the Ascension... I am to get ourselves another Blazara, Thundara, and Fyra, based on the same uh, formula I used for the original Fyra, you know, in the last session. So now we have these at our disposal when we need them. And of course we got our usual heal cast and unicast, so there's that. But yeah, I am excited to try these bad boys out. And I think that's pretty much it. And now next up... Ooh, skills, actually? Hmm. Oh, right, right, it's that stuff. Pondo's at level 6 photography, Agnes has level 3 cooking. Bios has four in survival, and of course we've got only one in fishing because there's no places to fish. Wow, and my phone just buzzed the moment I said fish. I think they might think that I'm actually fishing, pH and all that. Uh, but no, seriously. Yeah, level one. We need to build that up at some point, maybe in my off time, if I can find a good fishing spot. But now on to the interesting stuff. Ascension. How much do we have? I need to know this. We have 205 AP! My oh my! I'm gonna enjoy using all this stuff. Um, what, 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 wait, blah. what do we have so far? Is it just this stuff? Yeah, it's just this stuff, okay. Uh, Ultra Light Phase, further reduce MP cost of phasing. That'd be very helpful, especially against those freaking um, soldiers. Those Magitech guys, because I fight a lot of them, and uh, yeah, they do a lot of things. Boost Light, Blind Side, eh. Warp Strike damage would be helpful. Or strike to, to break demon appendages. So as we haven't fought any demons yet, I don't think I need to worry about that, but I'll definitely get this one right here. Point Blake Warp Strike, deliver a critical hit when Warp Striking at close range. For 333 AP, ah boy, that's a lot. As for this, blind side damage, meh. Blink boost, recover up AP by blinking through attacks at the last second. Ooh, leave a hologram to divert enemies. Oh yeah, that's something I wanted very badly. Significantly increased damage dealt after entering stasis. Wait. Oh, okay. And while the rest of the stuff is pretty decent, I think we could go for some other stuff. Unless you perform nurse. Yeah, I don't really care about this. Let's actually move on to a different category, shall we? We got techniques, we got recovery, magic, armager, um... Teamwork, stats, exploration, and weight mode. Next to the felt cities. Yeah, don't need to worry about that for now. Bows for exploration. Let's see. Gain AP for catching a fish. Increase AP gains for, for making camp. 
I gain AP for long trips in the car. AP for long trips by Chocobo. AP for winning Chocobo race. There, so this is just all for um that stuff. Okay. Um, I really don't care about that much. As for stats, the HP of each party member by twice the number of levels gained. Oh! Ha 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 ha! That's handy. And down here, equip two accessories. That'd be very helpful, wouldn't it? Even though we haven't even equipped one of them. Wait, what? Oh, just this is just for Noctis. Okay. And then these guys get can get the uh, other things. In that case, is it? Oh, that's for everyone. Okay. Health level two increase HP of each party member by five times the number of levels gained. The effects of similar abilities do not stack. Enhanced vitality of each party member by the number of levels gained. Vitality. What's the difference? Oh, we don't even have enough for any of these. They're all level. They're all 99. Brick. Teamwork. Link strike damage. Reflex. Build a powerful counterattack with a great sword and make enemies flinch. Hmm. I'm actually scanning most enemies' weaknesses on the uh, outset of battle. Um, that'd actually be very helpful in Ingus. I'd appreciate it if you could do that more often. Uh, wait. First shot. Gain first strike against a nearby enemy with a firearm as to tech bar. Ooh. Okay. And I guess that's that for that. As for gears, anything else I can equip? I don't see anything new. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Can't really think of anything else to get except, you know, maybe um, some actual items. That might be a good thing. Uh, how do I do this? Here we go, accessories. Let's see, Bangle Forge Bronze increases maximum HP. I could use some, a little defense if we have that. Is there anything for defense? Apparently not. Uh, let's sort this out. There we go, much better. Niflheim made best that can resist bullets. Um, that would actually be helpful. Again, annoying magic soldiers with guns. The protects the wear from poison. Oh, protects the wear from poison. Okay. This is strength incrementally. All right, I can I can work with that. Oh, we can really change our outfit as well. No jacket, casual outfit, casual outfit, no jacket. Okay, I'm curious what this is about. Okay, so that's obvious. Um, what about this? That's casual? Dude, that is so weird. Designed to defend against stat-reducing status ailments. Okay. That is so weird to me. Um, I'll go with the, out the jacket, but... Ugh, oh, that's so weird to me. Um, oh, you guys, crown guards, fatigues, no jacket. Oh, he actually has a t-shirt. His casual outfit. Oh, yeah, that's what he wears during the, um, the little training session battles. Yeah, I kind of like that a little better. And secondary arm and spell. Unfortunately, can't give him any shields, because he doesn't have one. Which is strange, because, again, you see him with that in, when you're fighting him. Uh, as for accessories, I'll give him... That... He goes, why not? Ignis, I'm curious what do you have. No jackets? Hmm. This is casual. Okay, it's just decent. I don't know, I kind of like him in his, uh, usual fatigues. But I'll go with this for one session, at least. Meanwhile, I'll give you, uh... That. And finally, Prompto. Uh, so weird. Slightly weirder. Actually, that one I kind of like a little bit. And, and of course, he's the only one who can wear the camera strap. Uh, a significant increase in the number of photos that can be taken in one day. So you better take some pretty damn good photos, my boy. You better. I'm, j I'm just putting it out there. Anything else? I think that's about it, actually. Shall we then? Ready when you are. Yeah. All that's left for us to do here is just camp and begin the mission. So we just get right here. Sleeping out under the stars tonight. Plus this way we can see what photos we got from uh from my last little uh battling session. Of course, zero days have elapsed. I am not that idiotic. 
Gotta make sure nothing bad happens. Let's see. We'll click this again because, you know, kinda got wasted. Plus we got plenty of it anyway. I guess they all skewers. They actually do look pretty good. You know, nice little uh, horn up top, but that's, you know, probably from the stick itself. Oh, he did automatically. Didn't even get a chance to press the X button. Um, okay. We got all that, and now, level up. Nope, no level up. We got 3 AP, but that's about it. Ooh, and his cooking increased significantly from that. I yep, like I said before, fought a bunch of magic tech. A lot of Magitek. This whole thing's literally Magitek, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> Nailed it. This should be a hit. And of course, by some gorillas. Perfect timing. <laughs> can't even see us in there. Oh man. But yeah, that just tells you how much I do when I'm actually, you know, grinding. And now, being saving. Now we must, must treat the regalia before morning. Begin the operation. Let's do it. Undaunted by the Empire's imposing technology, Noctis and his re retin wait, retinue risk everything to break inside. Archaeal stronghold and recover the stolen regalia. Retinue. That, that is a new one for me. I'll, I'll give you that. Ooh, but familiar. I think I might have saw, seen this one of the um, newer trailers to Final Fantasy XV. Our goal is the Regalia. The last thing we want is to engage an entire garrison. Avoid detection at all costs. In and out before it gets light, then. Indeed. Even if it means leaving the task unfinished, we withdraw before we overstay our welcome. All right. So infiltrate the base. Unfortunately, we got a checkpoint. Gonna need that. All right. Looks like I'm leading this, huh? Active base. Oof. Good thing you got Mac. Together on my signal. Until then, hold position. Wait, what? Do you mean three, two? One. One for training an imp Imperial base, Nidus can take down foes instantly with a warp kill from behind. Oh. Be sure to take advantage of the warp kill command as often as possible. Now. Gah ha ha. That's pretty impressive. Oh, frick. Give me up, give me up. Um, so that happened. I'm on nearby enemies, but we'll be eliminated before you can continue. Onward. So that yep. one's on me, definitely. <laughs> Good thing the spotlight disappears, right? Doing it, stormy automatically. What? Search lights. Well, no, duh, I can see that. We're clear. Tread warily. All right. Following you. <laughs> hey. <sighs> Take cover. Well, not you can do anything else. It's gone. Magitek armor. Don't want to mess with one of those. We should yep, have they're to. they're very powerful. If we keep to the shadows. Right. All right, look for our goal, yeah. Target the blind spot. One hit, one kill. All right. All 
Now that's one. Two. Where's the third? Right there. That's how it's done. Nice. Oh yeah, like a boss. Well, Ten AP from that. Oh, man, if you wish I had uh, blown that off earlier. Wait, do we just keep going straight here? Doesn't look like we can. Unless. Um, bad idea, bad idea, bad idea. Ah, I get it. Climb up. Ah, never mind, apparently not. I think we could do a little warp up, but apparently not. Seriously, am I missing something right now? Maybe it's just the symbols I think it is. I do this. I can't get in from there though. No, oh, but I might be able to uh, from right over here. So that's it. It's covered. Ooh, -hoo, shiny, shiny. Muscle stimulants. Really? That's it? Yeah, the things I do for goodies. Square one here. This is the way we crawled. Oh, we just need to go right then. Perfect. Sort of. see a key and a spotlight. Problem is if I know if I walk in there I'm gonna get the... Uh, oh wait, hold on. Or not. Oh wait, hold on a second. Never mind. I guess we're good to go. So we deactivate that. Is this what's powering the base? A Magitek generator of some description. It would explain why the troopers in the vicinity are uncommonly strong. I say we wreck it. Spare us the sneaking around. The risk is too great. Finding the regalia comes first. Not a sound. You'll allow the anime. Got it. Got it. Strategy kill the horse the soldiers. Let me know when to warp. Wait, what? Kick yourself later. Now we kick Imperial butt. BS. We're killing. Yeah. Not the time for horseplay. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean, didn't mean to do that. One side is yeah. powerful. Gronto's yeah. barely hanging on. Yeah. None the worse for wear. Jeez. See, this is why I hate stealth operations. It's hard to uh, know when and when you aren't, you know, actually hidden. And as such, it kind of frustrates me. It gives me a bit of anxiety, in a way. Now we can de deactivate this. It's right there. Hallelujah. There's the old girl. She's a real sight for sore eyes. And none the worse for her time in Imperial House. Oh, is to clear a path for the regalia. Alright then. Oh, frick! I thought I was holding out one! Someone help me! Heal, heal, heal! Thank you. This doesn't look too good. MPX men. Great. 
Yeah. Oh, and appears. Just break the leg. We're gonna go. Oh, what is it doing? Let's put it out of its misery. Yep. Pronto! Oh, hi there, opening. <laughs> oh, that missed completely. Freaking Pronto! And it explodes! Stay sharp. We're gonna sell some sword man. Pull it out! Ow, ow, break, break! Got it! Take out the enemies nearby! Uh, never miss! Easy for your weaponry, and Catch tumors and explosion to deal massive damage! We're just gonna make sure I'm not dying! Speaking of which... Where do I go from here? Like, where's the actual thing? They're practically dead! Am I missing something here? Yep, I think. And I'm down. Yeah, I think I'm gonna let myself get killed for this. Come on. I'm right here. Just shoot me. Kill me. You gotta check my name, wait, so I don't have to worry too much. And we'll just continue from the checkpoints.